Russian fixer, Felix Sater, rode to his office in the Trump Tower elevator. Like his associate, he had no scruples. Pump and dump, dollars or rubles. Then a deal with you-know-who down in Soho. Money laundering, that's a no-no. How do he make his millions? Russian mafia, that's how. Broke the deal for Trump Tower Moscow. <laughs> He's a pop star. His daddy, Aragalorov, owns a big car and a big jet and a big yacht. Friend of Vladimir, a billionaire oligarch. To the youthful idiot they toasted, the stage was set in his concert hall he hosted. Trump's Miss Universe Moscow pageant. Later at the hotel, well, you can just imagine. <laughs> Consultant worked for Oleg Deripaska, another billionaire exultant. Millions in dead Paul knew he just had to be patient. Called up Konstantin Kalimnik and known Russian agents. All past campaign data through secure communications in exchange for fancy bears hack and leak operations. A campaign which ultimately prevails and Lucifer Tupono hacks Hillary's emails. <laughs> Vesanitsky, I met with little Donnie Jr., along with Jared Kushner. That guy's got no sense of humor. He looks so constipated. Could be why he's always squinting. Ostensibly, they came along to get some dirt on Clinton. Then Kushner met with Kislyak, the Russian diplomat, and the Russian banker Gorkov, just to have a little chat. And Kushner turned to Kislyak, the greedy little gremlin, as to create a back channel directly to the Kremlin. Directly to the Kremlin. A man we hardly ever see met with Roger Stone in the Ecuador Embassy, while Maria Butina at the GRU's direction funneled millions to the NRA to help sway the election. Ilya Bykov used the accountant, Osher Shell, 20 million and counting. These facts are irrefutable. These crimes are indisputable. The only thing saved Trump from prison haircut, Stun and Manafort kept their mouths shut. <laughs> Active measures, handlers, Russian assets, big men, pick your pleasure, set at infinitum, no collusion, no collusion, don't believe your eyes, it's only an illusion. The gold, the great turmoil, and he's sowing mass confusion. Pushkin, Dostoevsky, please, yes, Keshagal, Sakharov, Kasparov, Gagarin, all stand tall. Their gifts are treasured around the world, acknowledged, yes, as such. But when it comes to ex head of KGB, eh, not so much. <laughs> Not so much. <laughs> 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 